Is that better? Yes. Good. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, Steve. Okay, this is an interactive session. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, Steve. Excellent. As a father, today, full of very mixed emotions, you saw that today. Uh, sadness that she'll be turning to Mike. Mike, you are absolutely perfect partner for her. I am so happy for both of you. But of course, she's now off my payroll, so that's awesome. <laughs> yeah. When Mike and Max got their house together, uh, he told me he planned on proposing to her the day they got the house. I was so excited for them. I can't believe my best friend finally found the one they got to spend the rest of his life with in their forever home. Now the day has finally come that we can call them both Zimmerman's, and I can be happy for the both of you. You have both treated me like family, and I can't wait to share your future together. Thanks for being... <laughs> A community of family and friends have gathered here today in God's presence to witness the marriage of Megan Lucy Greenwell and Michael Paul James Zimmerman. Megan and Mike, we delight with you in the love that God has given you to share. We pray that your love will grow richer through the years. May together you find the holy joy and delight that has beckoned you to this place. And may the grace of God guide and shelter you in faithfulness all the days of your life. This is your something blue. What is that? That was my Nan's. And you know she'd want to be here. Yes. So there she is. Frick, huh? <laughs> so we can just stick it in somewhere and pin it in. Okay. Yeah, put it okay. There she is. Okay. Now she's here. Huh? For the two of you, support one another. Married life is an adventure. Remember, you started out as friends. You will have ups and downs and many challenges along the way. But remember your friendship. Remember why you stood here today and gave your vows and be there for each other. I'll never forget the ride home. Um, I gave you and Mike from the stag. Mike said to everybody in the car, Oh, Mom, my heart is in trouble with this one. And I just smiled to myself, and I looked back at Meg, and she was giggling, and I knew she was just as sunk as Mike was. <laughs> Megan and Michael have chosen to plant a tree on this place that is mean, so meaningful to them. The tree represents marriage, but it also represents the gifts of family and life. In order to grow tall, trees require deep roots, just as marriage requires a strong foundation and deeply rooted nurturing. Seedlings need to be, have enriched soil to flourish, just as Megan and Mike are relying on the support and the love of their family and friends as they grow into the love they have promised today.
in the presence of God and before these witnesses. And before these witnesses. I Michael take you Megan. I Michael take you Megan to be my wife. To be my wife. To laugh with you in joy. To grieve with you in sorrow. To grieve with you in sorrow. To grow with you in love. To grow with you in love. To be faithful to you alone. To be faithful to you alone. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. In the presence of God. And before these witnesses. And before these witnesses. I, Megan, take you, Michael. I, Megan, take you, Michael. <laughs> to be my husband. To be my husband. To laugh with you in joy. To laugh with you in joy. To grieve with you in sorrow. To grieve with you in sorrow. To grow with you in love. To grow with you in love. To be faithful to you alone. To be faithful to you alone. As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. To my husband, if you had told me a little over three years ago that we'd be here today, I might not have believed you. What was supposed to be a regular Canada Day long weekend of partying ended up being the weekend that you flipped my whole world around. It's been 1,163 days since that faithful weekend. Megs, the day is finally here and I couldn't be happier. I finally get to marry my best friend and the love of my life. In one year and five years or 50 years from now, I can't wait to look back at this moment with you and quote Brad Paisley when I say I thought I loved you then. So do I make you wanna run. Simply say, I get to marry my best friend is an understatement, but there aren't any words that would describe how much I love you. I promise to be there whenever you need me, and I love you forever.